Can a person over 50 years of age follow the keto diet? An intriguing question indeed. Welcome to the world of ketosis, a metabolic state where the body, deprived of its primary fuel, glucose, starts burning fat for energy instead. This is the crux of the ketogenic diet, a high-fat low-carb regimen that's taken the world by storm. For some it's a revolutionary way to lose weight, improve heart health, and even boost brain function. However, like any diet, it's not without its controversies. Detractors point to potential risks including nutrient deficiencies, liver problems, and mood swings. But here's the twist. Most of these studies focus on the general population. What about those over 50? Do the benefits still hold? Are the risks amplified? These are critical questions to consider. After all, our bodies change as we age, our dietary needs evolve. But can the same benefits apply to those over 50? Let's delve deeper. As we age, our bodies undergo various changes, affecting how we process food and nutrients. Aging is like a double-edged sword when it comes to nutrition. On one side, our metabolic rate tends to slow down. This means we burn fewer calories at rest and during activity, making it easier to gain weight. Simultaneously, we often experience a shift in body composition, with muscle mass decreasing and fat increasing. On the other side, our nutritional needs often increase. We may need more of certain vitamins and minerals, such as calcium for bone health or vitamin B12 for nerve function and energy. Furthermore, the ability to absorb and use these nutrients efficiently can decline with age, posing additional challenges. These changes are not to be feared, but rather understood and embraced. They can help us make informed dietary choices that support our health and wellness as we age. So how does this all tie in with the keto diet? It's time to consult the experts. We've consulted a panel of nutritionists and doctors to understand the implications of the keto diet on those above 50. Dr. Sarah Mitchell, a renowned nutritionist, champions the diet. She points out that it can be incredibly beneficial for weight loss and blood sugar control, especially in older adults. According to her, the ketogenic diet's low-carb, high-fat approach can help reduce insulin resistance and promote fat burning. Contrarily, Cardiologist Dr. James Peterson expresses concern over potential nutrient deficiencies. He highlights that the diet's emphasis on fats might lead to an insufficient intake of fiber and certain vitamins, which are crucial for overall health. He also mentions the potential heart health risks associated with consuming high amounts of saturated fats. Dietitian Laura Chen, meanwhile, acknowledges both the benefits and drawbacks. She emphasizes the importance of individualizing the diet. For some, the keto diet can be a game changer, but for others, it might not be the best fit. Laura recommends considering factors such as lifestyle, health status, and personal preferences before diving into this diet. Professor Mark Williams, a geriatrician, reminds us that age itself is a risk factor for various health conditions. He suggests that while the keto diet can offer certain health benefits, it's essential to approach it with caution, especially for those over 50, so the opinions seem divided. But what does this mean for you? Ultimately, the decision to follow the keto diet over 50 lies in your hands. As we've heard from various experts, the pros and cons of this diet can vary greatly from person to person. Some may find it a powerful tool to kickstart weight loss and improve metabolic health, while others may struggle with the restrictive nature of the diet or potential side effects. The key takeaway from these expert opinions is that there's no one-size-fits-all answer. The suitability of the keto diet for any individual, regardless of age, hinges on their unique health status, lifestyle, and personal preferences. Are you a physically active person or more of a couch potato? Do you have any underlying health conditions or take any medications that might interact with a high-fat, low-carb diet? Do you enjoy the foods allowed on the keto diet, or would you miss your fruits, grains, and starchy veggies too much? These are all critical factors to consider before jumping into the keto diet or any other diet for that matter. It's also highly recommended to consult with a healthcare provider before starting a new diet. They can provide personalized advice based on your health history and current needs, helping you make an informed decision that's right for you. Remember, the best diet is the one you can stick to and makes you feel good.